today we'll call rock stars. That was the intro. <clears throat> today. <laughs> I'm so sorry, YouTube. That was ridiculous. That was. Oh, guys, I have a Zoom. I've been at it, but I'm re premiering it for my high school years. Today, we're here to talk about nutrient replenishing conditioner. You guys are probably wondering why we've been reviewing so many um, hair products because we only use two things shampoos and deep conditioners. That's it. And after a while, it gets pretty boring. So what we decided to do was buy a bunch of shampoos, buy a bunch of deep conditioners, and rotate them. Because sometimes we want to smell flowery. Sometimes we want to smell citrusy. And sometimes we're really tired of using the same shampoo. So to, you know, not use a shampoo that's going to leave build up anyway, we use, we like to rotate our shampoos, you know. Not doing the same thing, not doing the same thing. You know, hit them with something else. Hit them with something else. Hit them with something else. So, right now, we're talking about the Nutrient Replenishing Conditioner. How do you feel about it? I'm sorry. It was good ice cream. It's better. It's better. Um, <laughs> I love it. It smells like, you know what it smells like roses? Yeah, it smells beyond wonderful. It smells like happiness and roses. Um, it made my hair feel great. Wonderful. Splendid. Is that a word? Splendid? No. People are splendid. It was really, it was really great. I really love it. It's, it's lightweight. It's kind of thick, kind of not. That's but, funny. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, no. Um, she's right. The smell of it is. That was the top. The smell of it is very lotiony. It's very floral. It smells great. Um, it's waxy as well. So, and it's slippery. So it has great slip. Compared to the Shea Moisture's um, deep conditioner, this has a lot of slip to it. Um, it's nicer detangling your hair with this. At first, I didn't think it was a deep conditioner until I said leave on for 10 to 20 minutes using a heat cap or dryer. So this is actually a deep conditioner. Um, oh, this is the lovely conditioning cap I use. It works off body heat, but I use a dryer and it's majorly intensified. I would even say this is better than the hair steamer. Oh. But, um, this is really, 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 really great stuff. Um, it, I don't know if it's so nutrient rich that it goes right into your hair. Like, when doing with a Shea Moisture, my hair is usually white after using a Shea Moisture. When putting that in my hair, it's gone. Like, when I go to rinse it, I think I'm just rinsing off, like, a little bit of excess. My hair really absorbs this stuff. And I'm actually pretty amazed. Um... It's nice. It comes off uh, fairly easy. It doesn't leave your hair feeling waxy or dirty or greasy, none of that. Um, it's nice. It's really nice for deep conditioning and hair repair. I believe it. Um, it has a lot of um, organic things in it. Um, it is carbon-free. And um, I love it. No, and it also can be used as a leave-in condition. Well, no, mm -hmm. can't. No, it can't. I was reading it wrong, but I mean, Jane Carter Solutions. This was twelve ninety nine, I think, in Target. Not which, again, I'm sure you can get something cheaper, but for something that you don't want to mix at home or you don't know where to get the right um, handmade items, you can go ahead and use this stuff along with Shea Moisture. I like to rotate them, and um, it smells wonderful. It smells. Well, she really loves the smell. Good. Yeah. Um, and, it, and the smell actually stays on your head. So if you actually want a nice little, little smell smell, you can use this. Get to it. 